Well, good morning and happy Sunday to you, Tennessee Valley. Hope you're having a good start to your day. Once again, we're dealing with some dense fog here across the entire region. And then later today, mild temperatures, and that's going to set the tone for next week. And then it's going to become unsettled. So no rain to talk about this morning. We do have some clouds streaming in from the west, but the big story once again, the dense fog. Dense fog advisories in effect for the entire area, including North Georgia, Cherokee County, Southeast Tennessee and Northeast Alabama. These go until 9 o'clock Eastern time, 8 central. So we're going to be dealing with visibility less than a quarter of a mile at times here across the Tennessee Valley and that orange indicating low level clouds or fog. Seeing quite a bit of that across Jackson County, Northwest Georgia, back into Western North Carolina, and of course from Chattanooga up into Athens and Pikeville. So if you are traveling out this morning, of course, turn those low beams on because it is going to be foggy. Slow down, give yourself plenty of time. If you're heading to an early service this morning, leave plenty of space between you and the car in front of you. And of course, just be careful out there on this Sunday morning. As for your temperatures, we're dealing with 40s once again. In fact, this morning almost identical to what we had on Saturday morning. 46 in Blue Ridge, 36 in Murphy, the cooler spot, 41 in Altamont, 47 here in Chattanooga. But by this afternoon, we start to warm up. We'll get some sunshine in here. Still going to be a lot of cloud cover, but temperatures will climb into the mid 60s to even lower 70s. And if we can get that sun a little bit earlier, many areas will push into the 70s later this afternoon. But changes are on the way. Once again, we're expecting two rounds of rain. It looks like Tuesday into early Wednesday and then again Friday into Saturday. A couple showers lingering on Thursday as well. So that's going to be something we track out pretty closely. But of course, we'll have the fog for the first part of your Sunday. Maybe a sprinkle or two in the higher elevations going into this afternoon. I do think we'll get a little bit of a break in the cloud cover, but overall there's going to be more clouds and sun once again. And then going into tonight, really not expecting anything other than cloud cover and mild temperatures in the 50s. But then we start to track out our rain coming in Tuesday morning. So Monday we'll fast forward through because we're not expecting any bad weather. It's going to be a nice start to the work week. By Tuesday morning, some showers start to move in across Alabama. And then notice by Tuesday evening, that's when we could start to see some of that heavier rain as the low pressure tracks off to our south. And there's going to be a batch of really heavy rain near the center of this low pressure, likely moving somewhere along the Tennessee, North Carolina, Georgia lines. And that's where we could see a couple of inches of rain pretty quickly. So some isolated flash flooding can't be ruled out. And then as we go into your Wednesday, some of these showers linger, but that's pretty much going to be around one in the books. And then going into Thursday morning, we're going to be mainly dry. Thursday's looking pretty good. And then late Thursday into Friday, here comes our next round of rain moving in from the west. So it is going to be a very active period of weather. In fact, some areas can pick up anywhere from two to five inches of rain through this weekend. Uh, this across North Georgia, upwards of five to six inches is going to be possible. So by the weekend, we could be dealing with some isolated flash flooding. That's something we're going to keep a close eye on as we move forward. But for today, enjoy it. 69, morning fog, partly cloudy across the region, upper 60s to lower 70s. Tonight we fall back into the mid 50s, so it's going to be a mild night with mostly cloudy skies. Once again, temperatures aren't going to vary all that much, just slightly cooler into Blue Ridge and Murphy, dropping down into the upper 40s. And for your storm alert seven day forecast, Monday looking good. Rain moves in as we go into your Tuesday and early Wednesday, drying out for your Thursday before our next round of rain moves in by the end of the week, Xavier.